It was really important for me to nominate someone for Woman of the Year that really embodies, I think, what a leader is in our community. And in a time where journalists are being critiqued for their information, I wanted to highlight journalists who are going and doing their work every single day and literally saving lives. And Tracy Lair was at the scene of our Thomas Fire, California's largest fire, and also the Montecito Debris Flow incident. She was one of the first individuals there the first woman there giving us information that saved lives that helped in our community and I think it's really really important to highlight that that is a leader in our community and that is a voice that we need to ensure is always heard you know it's only hard when you're looking at the criticism but if I just go out there and just do my job and have someone like Assemblywoman Monique Lamone notice it means the world to me because I feel like we just have to we're only as good as our last story and we had so many disasters and I actually survived the mudslide and debris flow because I was there during the entirety and I actually showed my humanity because I cried on air and people noticed but I was overwhelmed by the amount of people that were dead and dying and I just had to tell some uplifting stories and find them and the heroes that were there needed our reporting because there were a lot of sheriff's deputies, a lot of first responders putting their lives on the line, saving lives and my job was just to show it because you had to feel it, you, we had to make sure that other people stayed out of the danger area and to think that that fire went from Santa Paula, a small town of 35,000 all the way to one of the most expensive uh, communities of Montecito into their backyard and from December 4th to January 9th caused that much destruction and we're talking 23 lives in Santa Barbara County, two lives in Ventura County. I mean the least we can do is tell the stories of the people who are gone and the people who are missing those people. It is a pleasure to see how this works in the capital in Sacramento. I used to anchor in Chico and to come down here is such a thrill. And I remember interviewing Assemblywoman Lamone the day she was elected. I think you were wearing a white suit and uh, it was the day Hillary Clinton lost the, the electoral college and she really brought it and we were trying to find something you know, positive about that election and, and it was really exciting to be on that election day and here almost two years later to see her working here on the assembly floor is something special. From Assembly District 37, Tracy Lair, escorted by Assemblymember Lamone. Tracy Lair is a reporter and anchor for KEYT in Santa Barbara in Ventura counties. She was on the scene when the Thomas Fire broke out in Ventura County and again when Montecito was struck by devastating floods. At a time when the media is under attack, Tracy is committed to ensuring her community is well informed.
What's up, Adama?